is the oh, our last full day in Universal. Yes, it's Thursday. So we're going to head down to the bench for the early access. Yeah. Some absolutely unforgettable experiences awaiting you just on the other side of these gates. But first, we have to open up the park. <laughs> Not gone to plan. Um, got in the queue for Velocicoaster, the second in line for front row, and then it went down. Uh, a long delay to the point where it's closed. But it was closed for what? Delayed for an hour. Was it delayed for an hour? Yeah, an hour. Um, so, but luckily, because we re didn't refuse to leave, but because we didn't choose to leave out of our, our own choice, um, they gave us a fast track ticket. Yeah, single rider use. For any ride. Quite good. Yeah, so. People were asked, leaving the queue and asking about that one said no. It wasn't until they actually physically closed the ride and said, right, you've got to go. They gave us a fast pass. Yeah. Um, and the gentleman, as we were leaving the queue, we were just talking, saying about Hagrid's. I said, oh, it's still delayed. Which So Hagrid's has been delayed since we arrived. And now, obviously, Lost Coast is down. So that's the two main rides that people come for, hotel guest wise. Um, but he said, oh, I'd recommend using this pass on Hagrid's. The queue's a lot bigger. Because the queue's bigger. It has just come back up to 180 minute wait. So we're going to head there now, use our pass. Um, and then we'll hey, queue for the Lost Coast no. later when it's about, again, half an hour, 40 minutes. Yeah, I think it's the Lost Coast, it's a quick moving. Quick yeah, and it's not so much family friendly, is it? Um, but we've just done Kong because that was a 10 minute wait. So. Try the fast passes on Hagrid now. Yeah, see if it works. Fingers crossed. How we get on? <laughs> Enter through Hogsmeade. Okay, you ready? So we need to head towards Hogwarts Station. It seems fairly quiet through this bit. Probably the quietest. Yeah. Definitely the quietest I've seen it. Pretty cool. These are the single rider tickets, so they're the red ones that we get given. Um, it's not single rider, single attraction tickets. Um, so we just had to explain that we had them and that we then had to go down single rider track and we'll show them at the, de at the door. So we'll let us in as a two. Yes, rather than a single rider. So hopefully we're all good for that. <laughs> Let's go then this thing. Yeah, let's see what there is. Yeah. yeah. side of the exit so this is single rider line as well because I've said that a few times haven't they now? I think the single rider line is back there then. Ah oh, maybe I don't know. Turn the left and go upstairs. Ah it could be yes. Oh. I wonder if this comes out near where we've queued once before. Yeah. Do you know where I mean when you first get on? Yeah. So it was on and off Hagrid in 20 minutes, which is really, really good. Yeah, we've just picked up a butter beer and hey, you can't see it. 
a shepherd's pie pasty, you know, go full English whilst we're here. Um, it is very, very hot though, the pasty. Just what is it? A little something cake. It's a bit peckish. Yeah. That's it. So we're gonna, it's not good. We're gonna eat and drink these and then head on for the journey. Yeah, this is like a Cornish pasty. Bit, yeah. 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 Good. How much was that? Ten dollars. A lot of money for a pasty. Yeah. Uh, pa pasty, sorry. back in London. We go to Diagon Alley and maybe go on Gringotts. We've got to go through Moe's to get in. Then to the food court in the Simpsons area. We went to the Cletus Chicken Shack. Yeah. We got a chicken and waffle. Chicken and waffle with lettuce, salad, coleslaw, tomatoes, and, and like a sauce. some ranch sauce. Yeah. yeah. I think like a honey ranch. Honey ranch, I think it was. Gar was it garlic? I don't know. Yeah, honey. It was um, interesting in there. It wasn't set up how I was expecting. Yeah, it's busy. Um, very busy. Yeah, a lot of people are getting crusty burgers. So the gentleman who was like in charge of the line, he was saying, "Oh, is there anybody who's not getting crusty burger?" We was not too far from the front. I think they so lining up bit more to go and just said oh we're not and he's like oh I didn't see you so as if to say just sort of duck under so yeah. skip the queue quite a lot. Uh, so this was how much was this? Sixteen dollars was it? Yeah that's sixteen dollars. Um, it comes with potato tarts and we asked for a buffalo sauce which yeah. might have been an extra. It was it was 99 cents. Oh what's oh. what spotty. It's fine. So yeah you could just you can get it as a combo as well we get another shake as well. Yeah. We didn't do that. We're just sitting by the what do you call it? Little Lake. Where they do all the fireworks. Yeah. Josh's top tip. Soak your buffalo. Soak your buffalo. What was that? You say soak your buffalo. Soak your buffalo. So soak your potato tops in the buffalo sauce. Mm -hmm. Keep rotating for a while. Yes. Until they uh, sucked up the sauce. They're very good though. Nice pieces sat here. Oh, with some ducks. Theme park ducks. They're really in ducks. What's your verdict? <laughs> what is your verdict on that then, darling, apart from sticky fingers? Uh, really? Yeah, it was. I'm really glad we got that. I've got the buffalo sauce as well. The buffalo sauce, yeah. Made it very nice. I think that was a really good deal. Wow. Mm. Okay, get back to uh, um, the Yeah. See how long the Blossom Coaster is, get in line. Yeah. Then it gets a bit sweet, maybe. Or head back to the room and get some more down up. Can we do that? Okay. Then what? I don't know. And, uh, and, uh, and then get the free cocktail that we've still not got yet. So we should eat this at Yeah, I think we should. Maybe go book a table. Oh, baby. Two. 
not got on the Hogwarts Express yet. It was a 45 minute wait, so we decided to jump on Men in Black instead. It's just 25 minutes, and then we came out with 85 minutes wait. Well, I think it was like half an hour. hour. Was it an hour we got there for? I think it's longer. Oh about, about two or four. Was it? Yeah, it's half three now. Yeah, about wow. Hour. Gosh. I don't know um, how. Walked in here to 25, and during that time it was like an hour. Yeah, crazy. Crazy time. Oh, we've got the mystery machine here. It's part on the roadside. No characters though, just the van. That's interesting. Yeah. Uh, we're going to head to the Today Cafe, is it called that? The Today Cafe. So we saw a croissant, s'mores croissant the other day when we popped in. Uh, but the queue was really large, so we're going to go in now and get a nice coffee and then we're going to walk across to Ireland because we're not waiting 45 minutes to get on the Hogwarts Express. It's just ridiculous. It should take about 10 minutes just to walk to the other side. Yeah, hopefully. Uh, and then we're going to go into the Marvel section, see if there's anything going on in there. Right. The Today Cafe. And then we're going to go on the Coaster. Because we need to. We need to go on it. Right, we'll show you what we get in here. This is the Smalls Croissant. Oh my word, it looks incredible. And we went for an ice latte with a shot of caramel syrup and almond milk. So we're going to tuck into this now. Hopefully it'll be yum yum yum. Oh, oh. Oh, look at that squelch. Mm. Yummy. Wow, what a, what a word. Squelch. <laughs> now we've got a nice view of Rip Ride Rocket going up. Just up there. It's a good little spot this, I like it. Off it goes. Woo! Oh gosh. Oh, what a close up that was. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, that looks good. Yummy. We're heading out of uh, Universal Studios now uh, after enjoying our small croissants. It's really good. Delicious. Definitely recommend the Today Cafe. Looks like they've got some good bits of like, breakfast as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, croissants, pastries. Yeah, that's so heavy, small croissants. Oh, so good. So yummy. It is looking relatively dark. Um, we're still going to head across to Islands. See what happens. Oh, one more time, at least. We are taking the route along past Chocolate Emporium and Hard Rock Cafe, so you can go down that way or this way. I'm assuming. So we're heading this way. Hopefully, no. That's the Blue Man Group. Oh. There's the boats doing a spinny spinny. Maybe we should get a boat back later. I don't know what time they finished running. Yeah, I forgot about the boats. They've only been only once. The buses are very convenient though, aren't they? Yeah, it takes, yeah, it takes it to the hotel. The boat doesn't. The boat doesn't. Right, should we pop into the chocolate and room then? Just have a quick look? I'm just intrigued to see what it's like inside. It looks very steampunk vibes, doesn't it? Let's see. Yeah. Song, yeah. This one, salted caramel apple. Yeah, we've had them before in a, in a drink. Oh, it's like a chocolate stick. Like a sugar stick. Yeah. And then there's more bits over here. With all these steampunky bits. Yeah, they're cool. I like the uh, bottle with the opera and stuff. Oh, we've got chocolate cooked bacon. Oh, I'll have to come back with some of that later. Oh, yeah. Plain salt. Smudge fudge. Oh, look at this. Oh, these look really good. Okay. We come back later? Oh. I think so. What is that? Yes. Is it an apple? Popcorn ball. Oh, I think it's 
some of that later. Yeah? Okay. Oh, yeah. Maybe one of each, because that one's got peanuts on it. <laughs> Anything we can do from here? Uh, just browsing for now, thank you. Browsing? Oh, I look good. Pretty cool. Yeah. Almost something here. Birthday cake, one at the back. Yeah. And then that must be the seated area in the back of the restaurant. We have finally managed to arrive at the that on the front row and oh my god it's intense. <laughs> really, really fast. Um, I tried to do that round in the air. Yeah, we both tried to, we both got to the same point, fuck down. <laughs> Oh, okay. I was just gonna come out. oh god, I literally was like hanging out at one side. I'm like, nope, nope, this is not happening. So, hands up further down, but not at the front. Yeah. Still not doing them. Um, so, it, we were in the queue whilst the storm was happening. Uh, but then we got through, for, as soon as it reopened, it was flying through, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, 10 minutes. And then I had to queue obviously for front row, which didn't take very long. Quite never now, I think. So. Yeah, <laughs> but it was nice to be in air con. Yeah. Out the rain. Of, yeah, and out the rain. So I think we're going to head to Hagrid's now. See if we can get on one more time in this trip. Um, we were going to do the water ride, but it's not that warm now. We don't want to get drenched. Um, Maybe later. See what we'll the fans see. are. Yeah. See you later. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, let's head to Hagrid's town. Well, we tried to go on a lot of things and it's been hard work. We have, yeah. So, one of the last ones was the Ripsaw Water. What to do? It's good fun. It's good fun, but Very you don't wet. do it at night time, so you don't dry. Let's see. I've had to buy Very wet. clothing because I am the sodden, absolutely sodden. Yeah, I'm still a bit damp. I know. There we go. Good night. Which actually quite nice. And I bought a corn dog for the first ever one. Very yummy. So we're now going to go in the Halloween shop and go on Hagrid's. Hagrid's, hopefully. Yeah, That's we're right. probably not going to see the light show. We would have gone the water ride a bit earlier, but it was delayed. Close. Um, Still. Yeah. Closer to the weather as well. Okay. Who's done it? A lot of delays today. Yeah, a lot of delays. A lot of closures, a lot of weather closures. Never mind. Okay. We've got a lot of coast to a different row. We've done the water ride we wanted to do. We've done Hagrid's. Hopefully we'll get on Hagrid's again. And we've done Green Gots, Aspen Journey and Kong, so not terrible. I can enjoy your I mean, my car dogs are really free. Yeah, you're not doing job. I might get some of mine now. Yeah, we'll see. Wandering around. Because all the shops are closed, haven't they? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it didn't take very long for us to get on. I think like an hour and ten minutes. And it was posted an hour and so it was supposed to be two hours, 120 minutes. Not too much waiting in the same spot. What's that? Not too much waiting in the same spot. No, it wasn't actually. Yeah. We decided to come to the, is it like a Margaritaville bar? Yeah, bar. Bar? So yeah, where the plane is. There's opposite. You can see the plane there then. Margaritaville's there and we're across the way. So it's sort of like a little beachy area. Sandbox floor, and just out the lagoon next to us. 
So I've gone for this time the lemon and blueberry margarita, I think really tasty. Uh, you've gone for the same one as last time, yeah, the, the jal jal jalapeno. Chili one, the chili rim. And then we've gone for, and then the, the menu is exactly the same, but it comes out in little boxes to take away if you want to. Mm. So we've gone for the wings, uh, buffalo wings, and it looks like you get carrot. A little takeaway box. Yeah. And the drinks come in plastic cups as well. So we've got celery, carrot, buffalo bites on this, and ranch. Bonus. Then the tequila spiced shrimp. Like tequila exactly spiked. Spiked. Yes. Spiked. Oh, this place smells good. And the avocado. And in order to eat that, we've got some nachos or tortilla chips. Look into them and enjoy. Enjoy, yeah. Enjoy our last night. Yeah. Are you this one? Can I miss it? Oh yeah, it's really good. Yeah, really, really enjoyable. Very, very chilled. Very chilled, very adult. Yeah. So we've just got back whoop, to the hotel after uh, our margaritas at Margaritaville and the food. The food was very yummy. Very good. Uh, we're going to have pudding now, so we'll quickly show you what we got from the Chocolate Emporium. We went for... Alright, Josh, get it out. Is that the... What, was that white, the white chocolate? White chocolate. Drizzled. Bacon. Dipped bacon, so that was one of them. And the second one we went for was... Himalayan sea salt bacon. Which is very tasty. They must have been $7 each because it came to 14 something, didn't it? Okay. With tax. Uh, we also went into the uh, Halloween, Halloween boutique. Halloween Eve boutique? I can't remember. Um, yeah, Josh picked up this shirt. So it's this year's uh, theme for Horror Nights. So it's um, every day is Halloween, is it? So, yeah. Every day is Halloween at Universal Studios. So I think that was $32, was it? I can't remember. Uh, $30. $30. Yeah. And then to match, we went for the checked shirt with the same design on the back. It's very soft. Very soft. It's a proper flannel shirt, and then it says the same on the breast pocket. And that mm, was... $75. $75. It was really, really good quality. Both the t-shirt is and this is. Mm, very soft. Um, all, all the Universal shirts are... Yeah, Universal do really pretty good soft. clothing. Yeah, Compared it's always very comfortable. Bush doll in the sea world, it's very nice. Yeah. It's been our last night in uh, Universal, which is such a shame. We've absolutely loved to stay here. Um, yes, I found a... Completely different perspective of... Universal. Yeah, I really, really enjoyed it. I found a newfound love for it. Um, I think because people only sometimes have one or two days, they don't experience it in the way you do when you're here. Mm. It's a much more relaxed vibe. I'm um, visiting here before Disney as well. Yeah, I think it's a lot better because we've always done Disney than Universal. Yeah, and try to fit Universal in almost. Yeah. But I don't think you can. To really appreciate it, you need to give Universal its own time. Um, but we've loved it, haven't mm. we? We'd definitely stay in one of the hotels again. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it's just been awesome. Really, really enjoyed our stay. So yeah, we've got one half a day tomorrow. We check out at one o'clock. Uh, we're not sure what we're going to do yet. We're thinking maybe Volcano Bay, maybe Parks, maybe Chocolate Emporium. We're not sure. We're going to see how we feel in the morning because uh, obviously we've still got early access to all the parks, yeah. which includes Volcano Bay. So oh, we kind of have. We'll stay over half a day at Volcano Bay because yeah, of the weather. Yeah, because of the storms. So a few of the things we didn't get to go on. We didn't go in the big pool. We've not been on the rough, lazy... Rough um, rapids. Oh, yeah, lazy Fierce rapids, rapids, I think they're called. Yeah. So yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, but yeah, we're checking in to Disney at three o'clock. So yeah, we'll so see. I think it may be keeping our bags at Universal downstairs. Yeah. See if they can hold, hold them, them for us. Yeah, so we'll find out how it all works. Yeah, so we will say goodbye to you all. Thank you for following along. We hope you've enjoyed our final full day in the parks. We definitely have. And if you've enjoyed it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you tomorrow. See you soon. Bye. Bye.